unbelievably. Kate Middleton, this has been obviously crazy. A lot of people are talking about it. And I just would like to hopefully add some clarity without giving too much clarity to the situation. So in case you missed it, I'll tell you what the story is. On Mother's Day, uh, Kate Middleton posted this family photo. And the internet, Kate Middleton has not been seen since she allegedly went in for an abdomen surgery at the end of last year, began to zoom in on the photo and they recognized that actually this was not a real photo. There were tons of Photoshop fails, a missing wrist for Charlotte, no wedding ring on Kate's finger. They're showing that even behind the photo, <laughs> I mean, they got really, they really dissected this, that there was a bloom in March or no bloom in March. The jacket zipper is wrong. And then they realized actually that her face and that smile came from a different photo shoot. And they showed exactly which magazine uh, she took the photo from. And the internet was just going crazy. Like, oh my God, this entire thing has been photoshopped. Where actually is Kate Middleton? Is Kate Middleton dead? She then came out and issued apology. It was very extreme because all of the photo agencies, including Reuters, the Associated Press, Getty, and AFP, withdrew the Mother Day's photo. And as I said, Kensington Palace issued a statement. Kate Middleton issued a statement essentially apologizing and saying, we don't get it right. We tried to Photoshop. It came out wrong. And of course, this just sent the internet further into conspiracy land thinking, I think some people actually think she's dead, like she's been killed and murdered somehow, and that they're trying to cover it by now just showing old photos. Guys, don't run away with your imagination. Uh, here is the best way to state some information that I have Kate Middleton is a human being. I think sometimes you forget that, that the royals are human beings. And so I'm just going to say, like, in terms of myself, you see me every day on the show, and what kind of happens when you're so accustomed to seeing someone is that you assume that their life is perfect and they never have anything that they're dealing with and that they never just need a private moment. And Kate Middleton just needs a private moment right now. She is not dead. She is not dying. She's not suffering. Uh, she is fully okay, and she just needs a private moment right now. And it's very hard to say that without people wanting to pry and to know more about that. But don't remove yourself from your humanity in terms of just how long she has served uh, the UK in her duties. She has been nearly perfect in everything. She has given up any aspect of what it means to have a private life, and she has done so willfully. She has stood by her husband, um, her family, and she has essentially been perfect. And it's hard to be perfect all the time, you know? God forbid you have anything going on. God forbid, I mean, I had a freaking foot surgery at the end of last year, and I went through a lot throughout that time. I talked about it on A Shot in the Dark. And and it's just, it's really hard to show up every day and to be perfect when the requirement is for you to be perfect. And sometimes people just need to take a breather. So just allow Kate Middleton to take a breather. Let's not put pressure on her. Again, you can take this to the bank. She is not dead. She is not dying. Nobody has, you know, put her in a cage anywhere. She's not suffering in any capacity. She just needs a moment to catch her breath and then she will be back. I promise you guys that. Hey guys, if you like this video, you will definitely like the full episode even better. You can find it by clicking right here.